black woman, scared to raise daughters and sons with a body full of slugs. I said I wouldn't be numb, but this seems incessant. Who's next on this hit list of genocide? Too many picket signs, too many simplified to hashtags and headlines. I'm a black woman, scared to raise daughters and sons with a body full of slugs. I'm a black woman, scared to raise daughters and sons who don't know that they are loved. Hello, everybody. My name is Laisha Farr. Like she said, I am the first Seattle Youth Poet Laureate. What it's like 
to be a black girl drowning in this world. Know what it feels like when they downplay the gold of our skin. I've seen black girls denied of their body, their galaxy standing in the front of the protest with the weight of the universe on their shoulders. But I know black women have a way of surviving, have a way of healing, have a way of holding black boys till the bullets miss them. How do you call us animals? Because I roar? I carry my ground soul in my throat, carry a whirlwind of black beauty lost in the streets. Why wouldn't I scream? Why wouldn't I bleed? Why wouldn't my womb cry? We love more than we can hold, but we love, we love, we never hate, even when the skin is being ripped from us, when our back is bent and they try to leash us, when they remix our existence onto another face, knowing what it feels like to be robbed of stardust. We still love with all this weight heavy on our back. Thank you.